Hey guys, just an airsoft review of the UTG M4 M5. This is the double version because it comes with the full stock and the retractable stock. Super spin, full hop up. Uh, this is the spring version, not the electronic version. I do recommend that one more. Um, the only bad part about this gun, I, I like it. I mean, except for this thing. That's the only. That's the only way you can put attachments onto it. See right here. And it's so high up, it's like attachments are like this high up that it's horrible. If you're using a laser scope, you think you're targeted and it goes way under or it just totally misses. So that's the only bad part. Um, it comes with that 500 mag and it can come with the 300 mag. Um, since this is the exact replica of the, of the uh, one they use in the Marines, they gave me the big, humongous magazines, even though it's a spring pistol. So I have, so it's spring, and I'm shooting 500 or so rounds. So if you want to use this in battle and do not want to reload, this is definitely a gun you want to get, because you're not reloading until 500 shots of spring pistol, or print spring SMG. Um, this is how you load it right here. Ah. I do warn you, it is kind of hard to load. It, it pisses me off because, like, it starts hurting my finger here. So, yeah, overall, it's a pretty good gun. It goes about 150 feet. I usually use it as a sniper. It works really well. So, yeah, pretty good gun. There's the inside. and It didn't come with much, just two mags, the gun, a rod cleaner, both um, the full stock and the retractable stock, and a... Um, a sling, and that was practically it. But, um, it's a pretty good gun, I guess. Uh, I do recommend it. Once again, I recommend the machine gun version more. So, um, so, yeah. Uh, it's full plastic. Um, yeah. So, no metal, no really metal parts on this, except, like, the mag release here. I'm pretty sure that's metal. And the screws. And this little thing right here. Um, uh, the barrel's metal. So yeah, they use this in the real Navy SEALs. In the Marines or whatever. So um, if you have any questions about the gun, just ask me and I can answer all of them. So there you go, guys. I hope this was helpful to you. And remember, you can ask me anything. Okay, so thanks for watching. Bye.